Hello friends, today we are going to read about Maria Sarapova, one of the most inspiring lady of the world. So let us start the video about Maria Sarapova. There is something very, very unique, very, very strange about Maria Sarapova and that something and unique thing in Maria Sharapova took her to the top of the world. She is always looked with ready smile and very attractive clothes, glamorous attire and that's something special which is there in Maria Sharapova took her to the top of the world on Monday 22nd August 2005 and she became world's number one in women's tennis and all these things happen in very less time if we talk about the behind years or the years which has gone before she just took four years to reach this pinnacle or the top of the world. The trip to Florida with her father Yuri launched her on the path to success and stardom. Her father decided that she should become a tennis player and she went to Florida. But it was very very unlucky for this girl that she had to face a hard wrenching two year separation from her mother Yelena. It means it was very very sad moment or sad thing for Maya that she could not go with her, not able to go because of some kind of visa restrictions. This nine year old girl had already learned an important lesson in the life that if you want to achieve excellence then definitely you will have to pay some kind of price for it. However, this rapid increment in a great competitive world began nine years before with a level of sacrifice only few children are prepared to bear a face. Little Maria had not yet celebrated her 10th birthday when she was packed to United States with his father. Maria Sarapova recalls that most of the time she used to be very much alone. She said, I miss my mother very badly. And father also. Father was working very, very hard to keep her training going on. So she couldn't see father and mother both. She was so young. So she used to go to bed at only 8 p.m. And the other tennis players, they will come at 11 p.m. and wake her up and ordered her to clean up the room and arrange the things. Instead of making her depressed, she became greatly determined that I have to do something great in this world. She became mentally tough and that time only she learned how to take care of herself. Maria Sarapova says that she never thought of quitting or leaving the game because she knew what she wanted is really very very difficult and for this she will have to work very very hard. She says when you come from nothing and you have nothing, then it makes you very, very hungry and very, very determined and specific towards your goal. 
she is saying that definitely i would have gone through more insult and more hard work for achieving my goal if we talk about her journey from the frozen plains of siberia to the summit of women's tennis it had touched the hearts of so many tennis fans for the youngster herself there appears to be no room for sentiment as she says if you want to be on the top of the world you will have to do great hard work the straight looks and the answer she gives when asked about her ambition makes quite clear that she sees all the sacrifices which i made to achieve my goal were really valuable for me she said i am very very competitive i work hard at my work and it's my job and that is my mantra for success to maria sarapova speaks with a pronounced american accent she proudly parrots a russian nationality she says that i belong to russia and i am a russian also but us or america is a big part of my life but i have a russian citizenship my blood is totally russian so if russian people will ask me to play for russia in olympics i can play like any other teen age people or teen age celebrities maria also like fashion singing dancing she like the novels of arthur conan doyle and she also like gowns and pancakes chocolate drinks and so many things maria sharapova cannot be pigeon hole or we cannot put her in a specific category her talent is so wide that it took her on the top of the world who would only achieve the post or the thing or the success she had taken this is what she want to say about her monetary gains from tennis of course money is a motivation tennis is a business and a sport but the most important thing is to become number 1 in the world and that is the dream that kept me going so she said that definitely i need money and money always motivates me but because my dream was to be number 1 and because of that dream only i worked very very hard and i achieved my dream